Hey everyone, my name is Sven and welcome to Foodsify. Now you guys might have noticed that I always wear black in my previous episodes or previous videos and you might be wondering, why the heck am I wearing green today? Well, it's not because I'm green-minded or anything, but it's Christmas season. This is my Christmas outfit, but I know the Philippines is a tropical country, so that's why we can't really feel the chills that Christmas brings like in other countries. But there are ways to feel that cold plus warm and loving feeling that Christmas brings. And that's why we're diving into desserts. Let's go! We're here at Vanderlust. Vanderlust Bistro is located at Tomas Moroto Avenue at Quezon City. This is a European restaurant that boasts not only desserts, but also their savory dishes. What caught my attention was the noisy desserts that they offer. Yes, noisy. If you wanna know why, then keep on watching. So ito yung bratwurst sila. It has sauerkraut. It's technically a sour cabbage. And bratwurst is basically a sausage na nanggaling sa German. And usually, ginagamit dito is veal, beef, or usually pork, like other sausages. Alright, try natin. Mm. Oh, that's good. The sauerkraut makes it taste a bit sour. Hindi siya yung ganun ka fatty na sausage. It's a bit leaner compared to other sausages. Mm. It's good. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. So it's perfect for dessert kind of food. And yeah, friends are giving us a hammer because we have a hammer. This is the hazelnut kiss na flavor. Let's put it in the bag. Ang German Schnibel, Schnibel, Schnibel. Not sure kung ano yung pronunciation. Pero yun. Hammering time. That's satisfying. So hard. Right. Okay na kaya siya? Yeah, I think... Okay na siya eh. It looks like a messy dessert. But at the same time, this looks like it's gonna be really tasty. And actually, gamit nila dito na chocolate is my favorite kind of chocolate. Which is dark, lovely, dark chocolate. Okay, ito. Mmm. Wow. Wow. It's really good. According to the kitchen, there's a dough inside and then coated with that lovely dark chocolate. And it really works. It's not that sweet. It's not that sweet. It's not that sweet. At the same time, you have that kind of biscuit crunch feel that's really satisfying. It's really good. Wow. And ito yung Giangiotto. Actually, chocolate dessert siya that came from Piedmont at Northern Italy. Makikita natin filling. It's just oozing out. This dessert really looks lovely. And sa gilid niya, you can see that there are some nuts. Let's take a bite. Wow. Man, that was satisfying. In a way, parang malos siya when you bite it. But it offers a bit more kind of resistance to every bite. Same with the German Schnibel. Sakto lang yung pagka-sweet niya. Try mo to. Bayad lang ako ng bill. May marunong. Ganito lang yan eh. Ganito lang kasi yan. Pinopok mo? Pinopok naman to? Hindi ba? 
In conclusion, this is really a great place for desserts. Not only desserts, but they also serve savory foods. So might as well check them out. So yeah, now that's done. Let's head on to the other dessert places. Let's go. We're here at Carousel Creamery. This is actually at Green Hills and Grabe. Dami talagang flavors dito sa Carousel Creamery. They said that there are 150 flavors to choose from here. And there are a lot of daring flavors that you can choose. Pinili ko is yung white rabbit flavor. Favorite ko to nung bata ako. I basically grew up eating white rabbit, yung candy. And this is really one of my favorite candies. And nagunat ako na may flavor of Carousel Creamery. No white rabbit. Kakaiba. And you can really choose a lot of flavors here. So for sure, may makikita ka na favorite mo talaga dito. And you can see that this ice cream is a bit thick. Na parang gelato na rin siya. Which I really love. Try natin. So yun, try ko na through the free taste. And I have to say it's really good. It really tastes like white rabbit in candy. Oh well. This brings back good memories. I'm having flashbacks with every bite. You know? That really is like white rabbit malamig na white rabbit which is even better oh the white rabbit candy isn't really that sweet so kuhang kuha nila the flavor ng white rabbit so yeah I got carried away and I haven't explained what white rabbit tastes like so white rabbit is much like sweetened milk with just the right balance of sweetness for me and this ice cream this flavor has a satisfying silky texture and it's also not really too sweet and that's a huge plus for me because I really get turned off when you're when you're eating something that's really too sweet but I don't mind sweet people like my girlfriend who also doesn't exist and to be honest it's not that expensive it costs only 105 pesos and that's really a good deal and you nakakatuwa na rin that you could actually have free tastes and then you'll be able to savor the flavor that you chose and I ordered this hot chocolate ice cream so it's the best of both worlds combined together and this drink consists of two chocolate ice cream plus a warm cozy milk on the top there are some marshmallows wow and we have this rich cream on top. Mm. Wow, hot chocolate. It's kind of odd that you can taste that warm chocolate and at the same time there's that cold cream. It's odd in a good way. Wow, there's something about hot chocolate that's really perfect for the Christmas season. If you are craving for hot chocolate, then this might be the perfect place also to enjoy your hot chocolate with some ice cream. Drinking a juice or some chocolate or coffee, that's room temperature isn't really appealing for me. So I really like the fact that this is still warm. Junk uh, in chocolate. Don't forget to rehydrate. Because you know, you also have to take care of your body. So yeah, I really had a blast here at Carousel Creamery. But we're not yet done on our dessert journey. So yeah, let's go. We're here at home. This is my nephew. Hi, I'm Enzo. And actually, I take out a cake from Bell Floor by Beatrix. Uh, how old are you? Na pala? Eight years old. Po. Eight years old. Let's open this up. Mili ka naman sa cake, no? You like cakes, right? Yes. Sakto. You'll love this. Are you hungry? Yes. Yes. What? You're hungry for the cake? 
sealed na sealed talaga yung pagkakapak niya para ma-retain talaga yung freshness. This is the frozen ube brazo. Ito yung best seller nila. We can't wait to try this out. Diba? Diba? Ah, mga pala. Kuha mo na mga plates. This one's for you. Some fork. Oh! Wow, that looks amazing, no? Yeah. Masarap, no? Pwede natin i-lift na lang ng ganito. Wow! So, yeah, cut natin. Wow! Lambot! <laughs> A good slice for Enzo. Wow! Wow! This time. Violet, no? Okay, natin sa plate mo. This really looks good. Oh, sige, try mo na. Mm. It's nice, right? It's yummy. It's like ice cream. At the bottom is the crushed grey ham, and sa taas niya is some ube ice cream. Ube is a lovely purple yam, and on top is the brazo filling, and then sa pinakataas is that lovely meringue. It's so cold. It's so cold. <laughs> If you like ube, like I do, you'll definitely love this. Look at that rich ube ice cream. Mm. Oh, namig nga. It's cold. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's good. If you like ube, you definitely love this. Melon siyang crunch because of the crushed grey ham. And then that lovely soft meringue on top. It's really fulfilling. It's good. Mmm. Wow. Usually, pagka Christmas, you can see a lot of ube around here in the Philippines. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Brain freeze. Oh, man. Oh, I have a brain. Every component of this cake is exceptional. And they all complement each other. So, are you full? Nice one. Sarap. It's really delicious. And the reason why we're filming at home is because Christmas is all about spending time with your loved ones. And of course, giving thanks and praise to our Lord Jesus Christ. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please smash that like and subscribe button. And yeah, thanks for watching. And just a reminder, drink and eat moderately, okay? We wish you guys a very Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays! Bye-bye!